In today's program, we are going to accept two string values. Here, the first string is sun and the second string is moon. So, the output of the program will be sun, moon. That is, we are concatenating both the string values. The speciality of this program is we are going to do that using one array. That is, one string in C. Let's look at the code. So, now I have declared the array of length 100 because the extra one is for the null character. I am assuming both the input string values will be less than 50 characters in length each. So 100 is good enough. Okay. Now I am declaring a variable called f length. So f length will represent the length of the first string. So when I say sun as the first string, f length will have the value as 3. Okay. So how am I going to get that? So I'm you going to use a scanner function percentage n which is a global variable okay so the global variable will store the number of characters read so i am saying strn and i am using the ampersand operator address of operator and storing it in f length so now the str array will contain the value of the first string in our example it will contain sun now i have to instruct the scan of to store the second input value after sun okay so i am going to do that using another scan of percentage s and i am going to say store after sun how am i doing that i am saying store from the f length so what will happen so zeroth index first index second index third index fourth five six seven so on till 100th index will be there now yes will be in the when i am giving the first string input as sun yes will be in the zeroth index u will be in the first index and n will be in the second index now f length will be 3 f length will be 3 because the length of sun is 3 okay so now when i say ampersand of str f length what I am saying, instructing the scanner statement is from the third index, because str of 3 is nothing but here. From the third index, please store the value. That is the value of the second array, that is moon. So, m, o, o, n. Okay. Then after storing moon, automatically backslash 0 will be stored there. So, this is the crux of the program. I'll just uh, remove these lines, otherwise it will give compilation errors. Now let's run the build and run. Sun, move. Okay. I'm not. We are not printing that. So let's print the string value. Print up percentages. Str. Okay. So now when we run the sun, move. So the output is sun move. Thanks for watching, guys.